Texas Builder, and today we're gonna see if we can make hydrogen using pencils. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> what are you going to do is turn them on. Now, and there is no wire. Okay, so how do you make hydrogen? Well, I have a chemistry set that has these test tubes with graphite rods in it. And if I remember correctly, positive attracts hydrogen and negative attracts oxygen. So I flip these to it and most of all might know um, that water contains two hydrogen atoms and one oxygen. So there will be more hydrogen and less than oxygen. So let's dip these in. So first things first, we gotta make sure we get some water. As you can see, I've put them in the water and now bubbles are coming out. So I think positive is actually producing oxygen and this is hydrogen right here. And in a minute, I'm gonna get a match and I'm gonna pop it or maybe a lighter if we can find it. Now that we got quite a bit in here, let's try to pop it. He did it! Good job. So what I want to know is if pencil um, lead would work because it has partly graphite. I have my dad um, putting the leads in of an automatic mechanical pencil and we're going to see if it bubbles. Oh! Oh! It's working! It's working. Wow, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's really good. Now we're going to try a Ticonderoga number two lead. And then my dad just freshly whittled. And let's see. Ever so slowly, but there's too much wood but it's slowly doing it. You know, Dad, why don't you flip them? That has more lead, so we can see more hydrogen coming out. Okay. So it works! You can make hydrogen using pencils. Now you just gotta up the scale and get more graphite or pencils. Okay. Hope you like this video. I was pretty amazed that you can make um, hydrogen and oxygen using pencils. I did it. I wouldn't think that would work considering there's mostly clay in this, but there is part graphite. So make sure to comment, like, and subscribe and for more videos.